Canelo versus Crawford, an absolute generational boxing fight coming up. First word that springs to mind. Woo, woo, woo. But aside from that, if we want to make a sound prediction, other than that thinking Canelo is incredibly cool, one of the baddest fighters of all time, I'm a huge fan. These things are decided by fine margins, so we need to look at the data. Data, 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 that's what we're all about at M2MMA. And if we want to be informed, we got to check out some of the stats to make a sound prediction. Over the last five fights, Canelo throws just over 33 punches around and lands nearly 40%. Ultra efficient. Crawford, he throws 46 around, landing just over 30%. Pure volume pressure. Crawford takes slightly more punches per round, but Canelo has almost double the career round. More fights, more impact exposure. That mileage can add up. Body shots are Canelo's trademark. In his last fight, 83% of his power punches came to the body. He stopped opponents like Liam Smith with liver shots. Crawford's done it too. He KO'd Julius Ndongo with a body shot. Crawford has the longer reach, 74 inches versus 70.5, but he's moving up two divisions to 168 pounds. And that's the question everybody's asking. Can he handle Canelo's power at super middleweight? Barely anything to separate these two guys. Canelo's 35, Crawford's 37. Which way are you leaning? Like I said, fine margins.